Gianna. Okay, Tony, put it beside my house so we can be neighbors. Okay. Neighbors, that's it. Now we need to put some more people in our neighborhood. Okay. Here's Mr. Boyd. He helps take care of the park. All right. I'll put him right beside the caboose. And here comes Officer Phillips. She helps keep us safe. So Barney, do you want to be our neighbor? Whoa! <laughs> yes, I do! Oh, oh, hi, everybody! What are you doing? We're making our neighborhood. See? Here are our houses. Okay, <laughs> let me see. <laughs> oh, this looks great! Here's the police station. That's the fire department. Every neighborhood needs police officers and firefighters. And here's the hospital where doctors and nurses work. Hmm. Oh, and this looks like Mr. Brantley in front of his ice cream shop. It is. Oh, the most delicious place in the neighborhood. There are lots of great places in our neighborhood. Oh, absolutely. Oh, I'm looking around my neighborhood and what do I see? Some houses and cars and kids like me. I see buildings made of brick. Were you sick, Sarah? Oh, no. I'm very healthy. I just went for a checkup. Well, that's good news. Oh, you know, it's been a while since I had a checkup. Does your doctor take care of dinosaurs by any chance? Oh, Barney, he's the doctor for people in the neighborhood. Oh, oh I see. Barney? Hmm? I knew a doctor you could see. Oh, you do? Who? Me, Dr. Gianna. Oh, great. Right this way, Barney. Okay. Well, I hope I'm not late for my appointment. No, you're right on time. Oh, good. Barney, hmm? the doctor is ready to see you now. Oh, oh thank you. <laughs> Here I am. <laughs> now open wide so I can take a look inside. Okay. Say, ah. Uh... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> well, everything looks good in there. Now let's listen to your heart. Okay. A nice steady beat. Oh, but can you dance to it? <laughs> First, the doctor checks my ears and nose and everything from the neck up. Then comes my tummy and my legs and toes. Soon I'm finished with my checkup. Doctor, I'd like to hear my heart beating tick, tick, tick. If I march, it even beats quicker. When the doctor's through and I'm all done, sometimes I even get a sticker. And I'm feeling extra fine, healthy most all of the time. But when I'm sick, the doctor will help, cause the doctor is a friend of mine. The doctor is a friend of mine. Yes, the doctor is a friend of mine. Oh, it's true. <laughs> Thank you for my checkup, Dr. Gianna. I feel A-OK. -okay. That's great. And for being such a good patient, here's your sticker. Oh, oh, thanks. Now remember, Barney, to stay healthy, you need to do three things. OK, uh, what are they? First, you should eat right. That means plenty of fruits and vegetables. Oh, yum. That sounds delicious. <laughs> and second, get enough rest. Oh, oh, I like to take naps. <laughs> and third, get 
get lots of fresh air and exercise. Like when we play outside? Right. A day in the park is just what the doctor ordered. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, let's go. Okay. It's fun being healthy. <laughs> Beautiful day. <laughs> Perfect for playing. <laughs> what should we play? How about tag or hopscotch? Oh, those are both good games for exercise. Hi, Bonnie. Hi, everybody. Oh, hi, hi there, hi, Jackson. Guys. Look, I got a new ball. Oh, it's really, that's really nice. Do you want to play with me? Oh, I love oh, we'd love to. <laughs> Exercise by bouncing a ball, bouncing a ball, bouncing a ball. Exercise is fun for all. Won't you come and join me? Jackson, oh, oh, it's not safe to go into the street by yourself. But how will I get my ball? We can go get it together. Okay. Okay. I bet someone in the park is looking for this ball. Oh, oh hi there, Officer Phillips. Hi, Barney. Hello, kids. I found this ball on the street. Does it belong to any of you? Yes, it's mine. Here you go. Thanks for getting my ball out of the street. You're welcome, Jackson. Helping people is all a part of being a police officer. I see police officers directing traffic by my school every day. Do you ever do that? Yes, I do. That's how we help cars and people use the street safely. Once, I got lost in a crowd of people, and a police officer helped me find my mom. You can always count on a police officer whenever you need help. Oh, police officers are terrific neighborhood helpers. Thanks, Barney. Helping people is my favorite part of the job. <laughs> The police are people who give help each and every day. If you like to help people, then joining the police is a-okay. <laughs> I am Me too. too. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Whoops. Here you go, Jackson. Thank you. You're welcome. I hope you remember to never run into the street. It's best to ask a grown up for help. Okay, I'll remember. Well, I'd better be going. I need to patrol the rest of the park. Bye bye. Bye. I'll see you later, Officer yeah. Phillips. Bye bye. To practice crossing the street, Barney. Oh, well, that's a good idea, Jackson. We want you to be safe. Now, who knows a good safety rule for crossing the street? I do. Hmm? It's important to be very careful when you're crossing the street so you won't get hurt. Uh -huh. 
and before crossing the street, stop, look, and listen for any cars that might be driving nearby. And be sure to look both ways before crossing the street. Oh, that's right. Just follow these few simple rules and you can cross the street safely. Can you help me practice, please? Why, I'd be delighted. Oh, oh my. Barney, you're dressed like a crossing guard. What is a crossing guard, Barney? Oh, a neighborhood helper who helps you cross the street safely. Look both ways when you cross the street. like fun. <laughs> it is. Do you want to play with us? Oh, I'd like to, but I have lots of mail to deliver. Oh, my. You sure do. Well, delivering mail is how I help people in the neighborhood. Hmm. Let's see. This package won't fit. Does anyone know who Tony Marino is? That's me. There you go. <laughs> well. Cool, thanks. No problem. Well, I'll see you later. Okay. I've got lots more mail to deliver. Okay. All right, bye now. See you later. What is it, Tony? I don't know. Who sent it? My Uncle Frank. Is it for your birthday? No, it's not my birthday. Well, whatever it is, it's always exciting to get something in the mail. <laughs> Think of what might be in a letter. Anything is possible when you use your imagination. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, hurry, hurry! We've got a fire to put out. Get the ladders and the hoses. Ready? Ready! Let's go! Here comes the fire truck. The people shout.
shout Hooray! The siren tells the cars and trucks to get out of the way Look at all the flashing lights and watch the water spray F-I-R-E-T-R-U-C-K F-I-R-E-T-R-U-C-K Here comes the fire truck Hooray, hooray, hooray! truck was really cool. You're welcome, Jackson. If you were a real firefighter, you could drive a fire truck all the time. That's true. But firefighters do lots of other things, too. Like what, Barney? Well, um, uh, follow me to the caboose and I'll show you on the computer. Oh, oh, oh come on, here we go. Watch your step. <laughs> firefighters do lots of things. <laughs> I'll show you. Let's see, where's that computer? Uh, oh, there it is. <laughs> Um, Sarah, would you turn on the computer, please? Oh, sure, Barney. Oh, thank you. Now, let's look for fire trucks and firefighters. Okay. Yeah. Here's a fire truck. Firefighters have to hurry so they can get to the fire quickly. Those firefighters look like they're wearing raincoats and boots. Those are special clothes that keep them safe and dry while they put out a fire. Wow, that siren is loud. Uh -oh. That's so the people in their cars will know to get out of the way of the fire truck. What's he doing, Barney? Well, he's going to use the water hose to put out a fire. Firefighters really work hard. <laughs> yes, they do. <laughs> Firefighters help keep people and buildings in the neighborhood safe. That's awesome. I want to be a firefighter when I grow up. Oh, you'd be a fantastic firefighter, Jackson. Thanks, Barney. Mm -hmm. Do you know what you want to be when you grow up, Tony? Hmm, I'd like to be a mail carrier and deliver mail to all the houses in the neighborhood. <laughs> oh, everyone likes getting letters in the mail. <laughs> How about you, Gianna? I really want to be a doctor so I can help people when they're sick. I want to be a teacher. And I want to be a firefighter. What I want to be, what I want to be, when I grow up to be big me. What I want to be, what I want to be, is a doctor or a mail carrier. Each day I work, what fun it will be. Keep our neighborhood clean. Ooh, there are lots of helpers that are important to the neighborhood. What other neighborhood helpers do we need, Barney? Hmm, well, um. Oh, well, how about someone to help you find books to read? That would be a librarian. Oh, good. <laughs> oh, and maybe someone to help you keep your teeth healthy. Like a dentist. <laughs> oh, that's right, Tony. And it's important to keep the pets in the neighborhood healthy, too. We need a veterinarian. Oh, right. That's a doctor for animals. Oh, you've built a super D duper neighborhood. Let's take a walk and see who we meet. Let's walk around the block to see who we meet up and down our street. Let's walk around the block. Let's take a walk with happy feet. It'll be such fun for everyone. So let's walk.
<laughs> yes, it is. It's full of wonderful places. And there are some really terrific friends and helpers here, too. Like mail carriers. And firefighters. Police officers. And doctors. <laughs> right. All friends and helpers help to keep us safe and healthy. But there's someone else who makes this neighborhood extra special. Oh, who's that? You! Oh, oh thank you. <laughs> It's friends like you who help make this neighborhood a terrific place to be. <laughs> I love you. She would take us to his ice cream shop this afternoon. Oh, oh, that's yeah. funny. <laughs> Thanks for a great day, Barney. Oh, well, it's always a great day when I spend it with you. Bye, Barney. Bye, Barney. Bye, Bye everyone. Bye. 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 Bye.